I'm holding up my favorite finger puppet of my hero, Galileo Galilei, an Italian of some renown, who also created our first forays into relativity and also had some of the first interactions, dangerous as they were, with the Pope that ended him up in a literal prison. Why is the gravitational potential well, what you've called Einstein's prison, Yeah. why is it so much more deep, robust, and escapable than, than was good old Galileo? I'm glad you asked that question. By the way, Einstein never made it into Bohemian Rhapsody, so you have to assume <laughs> that maybe it was worth, and you and I visited his prison where he was under house no, arrest. And sure. What I would say is the problem is the following. Imagine you go to a seminar in theoretical physics. It might begin with the following word. I'd like to thank everybody for coming. Let us assume that X1 comma 3 is a space-time man. As soon as you've said that, the game is already over. You can't do physics at the deepest level after you've said those words, in my opinion. Problem is, Einstein baked in this assumption of a space-time metric at such a fundamental level that we can't actually do anything about it after the fact. 